Hi, welcome to Awkward Amster. Today we'll be taking a look at this great video maker LED light kit. This one's a two pack. They do have a three pack. The model for this one is the 850D. Let's open up the semi hard shell carrying case. We have quite a few accessories. In here contains the power cables. These are the tripod stands. And the light kits are all stored in the straw stream. So it's like a uh, very soft material, cloth type of material. And here's the user manual. I'm going to take a moment to show the pages from the manual. If you want to read any part more detail, feel free to pause the video. I'm just going to skip past the disclaimers. Here's the product parameter. This can use the Panasonic batteries or just be powered, plugged into the wall. This is the power adapter. It is universal. It puts at 100 to 240 volts. Outputs at 15 volt, 3.0 amps. On the other end, it's a grounded plug. This is well over, but it's also maybe 10 feet. This itself is about five feet. Because the unit does not draw that many watts, I'm able to power this with my portable AC unit here. Now, there are built-in folds these can be removed though. I'd rather just leave them on because they allow me to adjust the angle of the light. There's also a diffuser that can be removed, but I prefer to keep that on as well. Let's turn this on. Both lights are turned on. I'm setting them to the same channel. I set this to the slave. This one, I'm going to set the mode, not as a slave, but this one's the master. So when I adjust this, notice how that one turns too. On the right hand side, I can adjust the hue, the saturation, cycle through them by just pressing down on it. I'll leave the saturation the same. I'm going to lower the brightness a bit, a bit too bright right now. And as for the Kelvins, this is very warm, 3200 Kelvins. It goes all the way to 5600 Kelvins. And they're both in sync. The next thing I'd like to demonstrate is the app functionality. The app is free, GVM2, free in the iOS App Store. I'm demonstrating this on the iPhone 12 Pro Max. And I already found it. That's because over here, I set it to app mode. On this other one is still set to slave. So now I'm going to hit connect. Place it right between here. I'm going to set it to a little bit brighter. See how it still controls both of these? That's because they're on the same channel and the one on the right is set to slave. I can also change the different color temperatures. I'm going to set it to 3800. That's how I prefer to shoot my interviews. I can also change the color. Also change different scenes too. So this is lightning, candle, bad bulb, disco, cop car, TV, party, paparazzi. Once I adjust the light to be in the position I want, I can just easily tighten it on the thumb screws and that will just force it to stay in that desired position. 
if I don't want to power it using the provided AC adapters, I can always put in two F550 batteries. GVM does make them. This is from a different unit. I just have one of them. But if I had two of them, these output as 7.2 volts. Once I have two of them, it's pretty much 15 volts, and I can power the lights for hours. They don't use that many watts. At most, 40 watts. Or, in my case, I just bring a portable battery. I'm using this mostly to shoot interviews and podcasts, but these LED light kits can be used for just about anything. YouTube live streams, Twitch live streams. Having two of them is a great way to get rid of shadows. These are priced just under $300. I do think they're well worth it, and I would recommend it. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Awkward Hamster. Bye.